Roswell Flight Test Crew here at CES 2019 in fabulous Las Vegas, Nevada. And I'm here at the Global Energy Transmission booth with our friend Leonid Plekhanov. So, Leonid, what's going on here exactly? Well, uh, what you can see here is basically a wireless power transmission technology. And we have here a system which can wirelessly charge drone in flight. So, we literally can fill in the battery for 100% in 8 minutes without landing. So this is like Nikola Tesla's old dream of remote power with no wires? Yeah, right, right. This is actually, you know, he was behind the basic physics of this idea, which is a resonant magnetic coupling, and this is the core physics behind the whole thing. We were able to put it and to develop it to the next grade of development in terms of engineering, and thanks to that we have this technology here right now. And so you've got this, looks like a copper wire surrounding the whole booth. Are we going to get cancer because we're standing here? <laughs> not for sure. I mean, well, <laughs> well, actually, this is not a simple wire. This is a Leeds wire, copper wire there, and more sophisticated wire on board, on drone, actually. And it generates a magnetic field, sort of a spherical area of efficient energy transmission. And then drone, equipped with our receiving system, gets inside this area it starts charging and it can receive the power and fill in the battery. That's just amazing. So yeah, what do you see as the future for this technology? You might think about it as a gas station for drones, okay? If you build a network of such stations across the cities, you know, in areas, then you have no longer, longer limit to the flight time or distance within the network. So now you can keep your drone in the air, in flight, as long as you need for parcel delivery, monitoring, security, surveillance, and in the future we can scale this up to be able to charge big VTOLs, passenger drones, and you know, I think in a couple of years from now we should be able to do that as well. That's just amazing. So how big can this field area get? Well, right now we say practical size is like 30, 40 foot in diameter. It can be bigger, but then you have more losses. By the way, efficiency is really great. I mean, from a plug-in into the battery, we have 80% efficiency. It's like magic. <laughs> well, it is, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Kidding. All right, so if people want to learn, are you deploying this yet, or is this like in, in the experimental stage? Well, actually, this is the first time ever we present and show product in operation here at this stage, at, the, uh, at this show. And we just a month ago, we've got FCC experimental license to run it here officially. So now we're in, the, we're in the process of getting commercial one, and once we get to that point, we can deploy first installation. I think it should happen soon, this year, yeah, for sure. So if somebody's interested in maybe working with you to, to test out this technology, to recharge their drones this way, how do they get in touch with you? Well, yeah, sure, we are happy to explore what other companies need, and we see a lot, a lot of traction from companies who use drones for various kind of monitoring, oil fields, infrastructure, power lines, agricultural, everything. And well, the easiest way to get in touch is just go to our website, which is getcorp, like corporation.com, and there is a forum you can fill in, and I'll get that message right away. <laughs> well, Leonid, best of luck to you with this. I'm really looking forward to hearing you know, how this goes, because it's extraordinary. Like I said, it's like magic. So anyway, from CES 2019 in fabulous Las Vegas, Nevada, this is the Roswell Flight Test Crew signing off. Thanks again, Leonid. Thank you so much. Great to see you. Thanks for coming. Yeah. <laughs>